and welcome to a bonus edition of Cracking the Cryptic, where I'm going to be attempting to solve, well, to crack a cryptic. Um, this is Dave Gorman's most recent puzzle, which appeared on Friday um, in The Independent, and I like Dave's puzzles, so I'm absolutely going to give it a go. And here, here it should be in the right position on the screen. Um, right, let's go. So, actor on The Simpsons, maybe. <laughs> um, I don't it's I don't think it's Hank Azaria or whatever his name is. Um The Simpsons maybe. The Simpsons is a cartoon a cartoon is an anagram of actor on. So maybe hmm, I'm tempted by animated cartoon here because the sim I don't know if that's a um a tautology, but I definitely think cartoon is the second mate. The second word and I think that if you animate the word cartoon you anagram it and that would give you actor on so this could be the word play uh, let's have a look at one down see if we can justify an a gold is looking good because the chemical uh, element gold has an au uh, abbreviation to trial TV show it involves action but lacks self-awareness auto pilot there you go that's correct because the two is just plain and a trial tv show is a pilot we know that because we've just released our pilot podcast so it is animated i think animated cartoon we're off to a great start playwright will be ibsen i think sees nurse following pal disorder ibs <laughs> is the pal disorder and en is some it's some abbreviation for nurse i can't remember what it is enrolled nurse or something um troubling quality ask for husband um troubling quality testy i don't know 11 across coppers that's going to be pence or p taking dope and ecstasy showing remorse penitence i would think um whoopsie hang on let me try and type Typing with one hand is difficult when I can't see the keyboard. Um, taking dope and ecstasy. Um, how is this working then? Pence. Taking dope and ecstasy. So dope. I'm not actually sure about this. This might be wrong. Dope and ecstasy. Uh, have I spelt penitence wrong? I don't think so. Maybe I have. I'm going to leave it in and just see if we can work our way back to it. So a bomb that flew over a hill, that's going to be a tour. It's aviator, I think, gets airmen. So a V1 is some side of some sort of missile, I think. Um, four down, manipulates topless teenagers. So immediately I see topless teenagers. I'm thinking take the top letter off the word teenagers and anagram it. Well, yeah, okay, broadcast, I think, is going to be the anagram indicator. I thought it was manipulates. But it's going to be an anagram of e-nagers without a for adult. And manipulates is going to be engineers, I think. Oh, although that's not got... Oh, it is engineers. I've totally misunderstood the clue. It's an anagram of e-nagers in without a so rather than being around the outside of the letter a it's just take this a out and if we do that we do get the right letters for engineers so we sort of backed into that penitence why is this wrong oh, what's this going to be as well troubling quality ask for husband oh a quality is a thing if you put ask instead of the the h of the word thing you get tasking and troubling if something troubles you it tasks you through uh what's this, this is going to be luger gun one found on a slippery slope oh maybe it's not actually um hmm, okay i don't know what that is one found on a slippery slope a luge a luge oh i see somebody who rides on a luge which is a sort of weird, very dangerous looking sled um is, is the luge the one man thing i, I don't know but luges are very dangerous don't go on them uh 14 down irregular glue ear so an anagram, oh, probably an anagram of glue ear dr will clean oh will clean occasionally uh will clean occasionally 
that's appalling that I can't get that. Uh, ideas man is stopping other queen moving round. Ideas, theories, ideas man, theorizer. I think theorizer feels right to me. I can see that ends in ER, which would be an abbreviation for queen, as in Elizabeth Regina. Stopping other... Uh, well, I can see there's an anagram of other. Yeah, is, which is, is here, is stopping other anagrammed an ER. So it's sort of a slightly indirect anagram, anagram of other ER, but it's, it's very clear what it's doing. So that's forgivable. Um, it's designed with you in mind. For this reason, don't start cryptic. It's designed with you in mind. For this reason, don't start cryptic. I don't know what that is. I have no idea. Uh, blame kept out of sight in church. Okay, well, if you blame someone, you chide them. If you So kept out of sight is hid. And that's in an abbreviation for church. There are two abbreviations for church that come up all the time. CE for Church of England and CH, which is just for, sh for church. <laughs> Independent, well, that can be abbrevi an abbreviation for I. Politician, if you see politician, think MP. So I'm doing this clue entirely without reference to the, the definition yet. Two journalists, okay. If you see the word journalist, think of an editor of a newspaper abbreviated to ED. And I bet you the answer is impeded and it is obstructed. So purely solvable if you have any experience with the various abbreviations that you need in cryptic crossword land. So enlisted revolutionary when I deported some characters. Enlisted. I want that to be sort of... Uh, oh, I don't know. When I do... Enlisted revolutionary some characters. I don't know what that is. Sorry, I don't know. Eccentric is probably odd. Playing banjo, entertaining millions, is jack of all trades. Ob job man? Yes, it is ob job man. So what we've got here is an anagram. We've got eccentric odd, and then an anagram of ban banjo around M for millions, because M is being entertained. Uh, it's being hosted. Uh, by the anagram of banjo and a jack of all, all trades is an odd jobman. Lots of weird letters in that. Uh, jog, so this will be nudge. Naked, nude, around center of Margate. Well, the central letter of Margate is G. So that one, again, I think even if you had never done a cryptic crossword, this would be a good one to start with because, you know, how many synonyms are there for naked? What could the center of Margate really mean? I mean, it's not, there are, there are no synonyms, believe me that specifically refer to the center of Margate. Um, some cattle rustler, finally, wearing symbol of peace. Well, a symbol of peace is a dove. So a rustler, finally, well, that's gonna be the final letter of the word rustler, an R. So if that's wearing, i.e. it's inside the word dove, we get the word drove and some cattle. You get a drove of cattle. Enlisted roped in that's what that's going to be i don't know why yet but it definitely fits the definition and all the letters so revolutionary that could be a red when i deported some characters revolutionary i'm now thinking about robes yeah, but i don't think that's re re relevant revolutionary when i deported some characters oh look that's very clever if you reverse when i deported and then look inside you can see r-o-p-e-d-i-n spelt out so that was sort of a hidden goodness me that's clever um it's designed with you in mind ergonomic that could be it could be ergonomic actually for this reason ergo that means thus, doesn't it? Don't start cryptic, ergonomic, oopsie. Oh, okay, yeah, nomic, uh, G-N-O-M-I-C, can mean cryptic. So we don't start the word nomic, we get rid of the G at the start, add it to ergo, and we get ergonomic. So it's all looking good, although I haven't justified penitence still. So let's look at 16 down. Wordy newspaper reversed rule on use on use to wipe bottoms. Wordy what? G 
garrulous or something. Newspaper reversed. Rule unused to white bottoms. Oh, uh, this is totally confounded me with its reference to bottom wiping. I'm going to move on. A uh, hundred players in audition with leading agents to make some bread. Japatis or something. hundred players in audition. Cast. CIA leading agent. Okay, there's lots. Oh. Um. Hmm. I'm thinking, what's the Italian? I don't know. I'm not sure. Henry rejecting Berlin's hair dye. Henna, probably. Yes, it is. It's Henry, which is a, a, a unit in physics. So it has an abbreviation, which is H. Rejecting Berlin. Well, Anne Berlin, if we reverse Anne, we get Henna, which is a hair dye. 20 down. Essentially the, that's probably the, the essence of the word the, the central letter, the H. High priests, a serial cafe regular. A serial habit you. Uh, a serial. Oh, I should be able to get that. Can't get that either. It's not going very well actually in the bottom of the grid, is it? Uh, I've got my irregular glue ear doctor. Um, don't know what that is. Irregular. Is it gorilla? Good grief, it is. I was not expect. I thought this was for certain an anagram of glue ear doctor. But I've just noticed if you take the regular letters, the occasional letters, just take the odd letters, i.e. the odd numbered letters, one letters 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, etc. from the string glue ear doctor will clean. I think you can spell out gorilla and you can that's extraordinary uh, and a gorilla is an irregular an irregular soldier so that's going to be right dodges game rackets yeah rackets is a game and a, sort of a dodge is a racket Jolie richardson's <laughs> expressing emotion that's brilliant whatever the answer to this is if it's in oh it's lyric okay Emotion, expressing emotions. I think it is lyric, isn't it? I can see Jolie Richardson surrounds the word lyric, so it expresses. And lyric, lyric, I think can mean emotions. Oh, not lyric though, that can't. Um, 21 down, steals seat back. Steals. Mm, st Ah, lutes, yeah, stool, if you rever reverse the word. Stool, you get lutes, which means steals. And so what's this going to be? Let's try and guess it without looking at the answer. Um, or looking at the clue, I should say. No, got nothing. Okay, oh, okay, it's two words. Oil well, then. It supplies crude, yes. Painting is an oil. Uh, in effect, if you do something effectively, you do it well. What's this long one at the bottom? Sailor, smooth voyage on board ship bearing European flag. Well, flag that fits that is stars and stripes, isn't it? So it's probably that. Let's put it in and try and justify it. Stars and stripes. So sailor, tar, sands for smooth. You sand something, you smooth it. Um, voyage is a trip. On board ship SS, the SS, uh, you know, S steam ship or whatever it is. Um, SS is certainly an abbreviation for ship bearing European, which is that little e at the end. And put that all together, you get stars and stripes. So this one's going to be nylon or colon. That's my two guesses. Uh, it's not, is it? It's pylon. <laughs> Copy, long division. Can it raise the power? Uh, copy yes uh pylon it's it's actually it's hidden again p y l o n there we go so pup has got a brand new bag after interruption by posh london philharmonic orchestra player <laughs> what on earth pup has got a brand new bag after interruption posh will be you it's always you the letter u some some reason in crosswords has come to mean posh. I think it was used to be used as some sort of mark of social standing. Um, what's this one? 
Oh, this is not... I thought this might be Habitude, didn't I? Cafe Regular is a... I don't know. 23 down. Get Government File. If you get something, you grasp it. Government can be G. If you file something, you rasp. So grasp sounds very good there. What's this then? Is this... Is this chip... Cheer patters or something. Players in audition, so it's going to be a homophone. Players. Players are batters, okay. Uh, as in somebody who bats in cricket is a player of cricket, so cheer patters I think is correct. Agent CIA obviously at the start. What is this word? Oh, no, it's two words. Oh. So the second word is very strange. Philharmonic Orchestra Player. Whoa, I don't know. Hopefully we can get this 25 across. Reject striking actors. Well, the actors are the cast. If you're striking, if you're on strike, you're out. So put out and cast together, you get reject, and a reject is an outcast. So this does look like garrulous, doesn't it? Garrulous. Let's put it in and just have a think about why it might be right. Um, reversed rule. <laughs> this is the bottom white one. New wordy newspaper. Rag. Okay, so rag is being reversed at the start. Rule. Ah. Oh, this is clever. <laughs> so if you wipe the bottom letters i.e. get rid of the bottom letters of the word rule, on, and use, you get R-U-L-O-U-S, which is the answer. So that was harder than I was expecting. What on earth is this? Papa's got a brand new bag. <laughs> After interruption by posh London Philharmonic Orchestra player, Paul somebody? Is there a famous... Oh, I'm going to show my ignorance here about things like this. Essentially the high... The high priests. A serial cafe regular. Essentially the... I'm just certain that's the H. That feels right. High priest. Maybe an anagram of P. Ah, hipster. A hipster might be somebody who goes to a cafe a lot. So high priest is saying anagram, the word priest. Because if, if meat is high, for example, it's off. So you're, you're making the word priest off. And a serial cafe regular. Okay, well, I guess that's hipster. So what on earth is this? I don't know, I don't know this. Oh, Paul, Paul Pogba. It's not Paul Pogba. You can't have a Man United player in a crossword. Oh, good grief. Um, Dave, where's the Liverpool players? Ah, Papa's, so Papa P, that's got A. I don't know why it's Paul Popper, I haven't got a Scooby-Doo. Right, I'm putting it in though. Oh, is it going to say I've finished? Um, penitence, I'm going to check penitence. Oh, it says it's right already. Sorry, and I'm, we'll have to justify it now. So why is Paul Popper right? So, got a brand new bag. Got, so Papa P, it's got A, I think that's this A. Brand new bag is an anagram of bag. After interruption by Posh, which is U, London Philharmonic Orchestra, LPO must be an abbreviation, that's extraordinary. And a player, not of music, but of football, is Paul Pogba. That is a brilliant clue, good grief. So the only one I've got to check out is this one, Penitence. Coppers, that must be Pence, mustn't it? Taking dope. The dope, is it the dope? And ecstasy? Oh dear, I'm making a light hash of this, aren't I? Um, coppers. There's so many ways you can arrange pence around this. And this dope is, oh, a knit. Maybe a knit as in a nitwit is a dope. I was thinking of dope as in information, like Jen is a very popular 
crossword abbreviation. So, okay, I'll go with that. I think that's going to be right. So it's P E, this P, this E, this N, this C, this E, pence for coppers, taking dope, which I think is knit, and E, ecstasy, as in a tab of ecstasy. And if you show remorse, you're showing penitence. So it's a lovely crossword again. What I like about Dave's puzzles is that they are always witty and that you'll always find three or four clues that just make you smile. And what better reason can there be to do cryptic crosswords than that? So big thanks to Dave. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And we'll be back later with a Sudoku edition of Cracking the Cryptic.